Hi, I'm Anissa Ismail. I'm a postdoc at Princeton University where I work on interkingdom quorum sensing and I'm super excited to show you what I do every day. No one really understands how it is that we can keep a hundred trillion bacteria inside of us without them making us sick. Nature's given us this amazing gift in these bacteria that we work with in lab where they make light when they talk to you and it's so easy to see and so it's either a yes or no answer where are they talking? Well, if they are, they're making light. I love to ask why and I want to know how things work. If bacteria can talk to each other, why can't we talk to them? If we can manipulate the type of communication that we have between our cells and the bacteria as possible, then we can change the dynamics of the bacterial populations that live inside of us from a disease state to a healthy state. When one experiment didn't work, I kept at it until I figured out a way to make it work. That lights a fire under you. You get the one experiment that works and you are revitalized again. It's fantastic. We have lots of collaborative lab meetings, some type of group meetings and discussions during the week. It teaches you to work in a group. All of this can only help you be a better scientist just because you learn that there are so many different ways to look at things. Every field needs women, but science especially, just because it has so much impact in everyone's lives. I was interested in looking at Crohn's and colitis. All of that will be funded principally by the L'Oreal money. L'Oreal has this amazing website for girls in science. I think that's a huge opportunity for girls to learn about the different avenues of science that you can go into. What I love about science is that it is everywhere and that you can see it and I can geek out on it at the museum or, you know, just walking around outside when you think about the changing of colors of the leaves or whatever. And I think that that's part of the charm of what we do. It is everywhere and you can enjoy it regardless of whether you're in lab or not. There's so much creativity in it and the kinds of questions that you can ask are limitless. 